Hello and welcome to another episode of Dolly TV. Today we're going to be playing with microscopes. Unfortunately, we did film it yesterday and we put it up. Well, we were going to put it up yesterday, but we had trouble with our computer and we lost it. It's like, ah! So we've done it again today. Well, we've done a very similar one today and we're going to put it up for you. So, what is it we're actually doing? What are we doing, Spence? We are. We've got a microscope here and what we can do with this is look at things that are really small. So, I say, I know what, let's have a look at this because it's really interesting. Well, you want to look at strawberry? Yeah? All right then, let's look at strawberry. I will start, let's just start recording. Right, let's have a look at strawberry then. So if I zoom out with the camera, here we go, let's put this on the strawberry. We're not seeing much there, are we? But there you go, look. We zoom in, look at that. That's the seeds. I can turn this light thing so it looks a bit different. No, it doesn't look hugely different. There you go, look. So in each, and you see those little dots on the outside of a, of a strawberry? Each one of them is like a little seed look. And I never noticed it before, look. Can you see the little seed's got like a little bit that sticks off it? Isn't it? Should we go in even closer? Ready? What we can do is zoom in. There you go, look, look at that. Oops, oops, I didn't take much movement. There we go, look. Uh, no, wrong way again. Which way, Daddy? It's all back to front. There we go. Oh, I'm rubbish at this, aren't I? Let's zoom in. There you go. Oh, look at that. Look. It's like a tiny little nut, isn't it? Let's zoom out so we can have a look at where it is and what it's doing. There you go. So that's what a strawberry looks like. Should we look at some more stuff? Yeah. Yeah, right. Let's have a look at some money. Mine. Ready? Look, let's see what the Queen's eyeball looks like. Ready? Let's get this the right way around. Whoops, a minute. There we go. So what we've got here, look at that. That's it's the Queen's eye look, printed. Yeah, it is, isn't it? It's made of lines and dots and all sorts of things. Let's go even closer. Ready? Look. You can see the ink on the paper, can't you? Look at those tiny little dots. No wonder they're hard to forge. Should we have a look at some of the bits? I know on here there's some really tiny writing in some places. No. With your head. But there's also another. There's button. all sorts of bits. Should we have a look at that shiny bit um, on the but, top? But there's a good thing. What? Because. Oh, if we look at this sparkly thing here, move your head out of the way, I can't see. There we go, look at that. Look. That's unusual, isn't and it? And then the person. Yeah, look, we've got another person there, look, another eye. That's um, Winston Churchill. I think hidden in here, look, on the money, look, there's all sorts of pictures, writing everywhere, and I think somewhere there's some really, really tiny words as well that are all hidden up. That says, what's that say? Beyond? <laughs> the Bank of England, that's what that means. Yeah, look. And let's have a look. There should be, there's this hologram thing. Look at that. Look at that. What's that one called? Everyone calls it Big Ben, but I think it's called, is it the um, Elizabeth the, Tower or something, isn't it? Yeah, oh, the Elizabeth Tower, because inside of it is called Big Ben. That's the bell, isn't it, that's called Big Ben, yeah. Isabella told us that one. I didn't know that. You see, he'd been learning all about it at school. Look at that, that's colourful. Hologram. Look, little patterns everywhere. What's this thing over here, look? Oh, look. And then I'm sure somewhere over here, look, there, can you see that writing there, look? Should we go in even closer? There you go, look, look at that. It says five pounds. Let's go, this one's printed on plastic, isn't it, this money? And now let's look at the Should five. We look at the um, five? There you are, let's have a look at the five. Yeah, it's got like a pattern in it, hasn't it? I wonder if there's any sort of like more hidden things you could find on this. There's lots of different things, isn't there? coats of arms and stuff like no. that. Anyway, that's enough of the money. Here's another co Should we have a look at the coin? Because we've got some creepy bugs to look at in a bit, haven't we? Here we go, look at this. This is, this is a pound coin, one of our new ones. Let's see if we can make it look a bit better. Oh, and then look. we could look at a chick. Look at all these tiny little bits on it, look. See that there, look, really, really tiny on the edge of the coin, look. Let's zoom right in, watch. Right on the edge of the coin here, it says, let's turn that around. 20. 
2017 look. That is so tiny. Just look, look at that. And then if we zoom out, you can see where it is, look. Right there. Yeah, look and at that. And also we could look at this. You want to look at this? Now this probably won't look like much, it'll just look all furry look. Won't it? Yeah, look. That's what fluffy now, stuff looks it, like. put it backwards. What do you mean, you put it back? It that's, that's the most, that's the nearest I can get it. Look, that's what it is. There, look. It's all bitty and fluffy. Let's look at some more interesting stuff. This is quite interesting. I've done this before. Watch this, right? This is a pen or a biro. Let's get this focused in, and you can actually see. Look, see the ink. Watch, watch it. Ready? Let's get the pen going. Look at that. Look, you can see the ink going into the paper. Look at that. Look. That's actually working. It is, isn't it? Look, you, see, you can see the little fibres in the paper and how the ink goes in. And in the end, if I turn it round, let's have a look. Look in the end of it there. Can you see it? Look, there's a tiny little ball. There's the little ball bearing in the end. Look. And that's how they make it and that's where the ink comes out. So yeah, so that's how the uh, ink comes out of that. Let's have a look at some other stuff. Oh, I remember these. What were these that we had the other week? What are these called? Bunchums. Bunchums. Yeah, let's have a look at some bunchums really close up. That's so what bunchums look like. Ah. Mm -hmm. Really close up. You can see all the different little hooks and things on it, can't you? Look, look at that. And each of those little plastic hooks like hooks into the next one. Isn't it? Right, let's have a look at something else. Should we... I know what. Let's have a look at a microchip. Now, most TVs and other things like that have got these in them. Well, probably not one like this. What's this? This is a, see this? All right, let's zoom in. Look at this, what? This is a microchip. Look at that. This looks like it's got a whole city inside it, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. You see it? Yeah. So, what we can do is we can go even closer. Let's go right in there and have a look, watch through the glass. Look at that. So that's what a microchip's made up of. All those tiny little bits. And if you look carefully, on the edge look, there's little tiny wires that connect all the circuit together. Inside all these little bits, look. Someone has to make that. How on earth do they do that? That's crazy, isn't it? Like a painter. A painter person. Well, they use, they use photography. I'm trying to think what it's called now. It's some sort of stereolithography or something. And they build it up and they make it. So inside your mobile phones and televisions and anything that's electrical that's got microchips in it, they've got these in there. Though. And they're tiny, tiny little things. And there we go. Look, if we zoom out a bit. And to give you, try and do a bit of a comparison. See, there's the ballpoint pen. Uh, I'm not to show you. There's the ballpoint. I'm not to show you just how small that microchip is. Uh, tiny. And on it is all those things that make your mobile phone and other things. Like, right, what else have we got? We're working our way up to creepy stuff now. So, we have got... Ooh, we've got a big fly. Should we have a look at that now? If you don't like creepy things, I'd turn away now. Because we've got a fly. We found a dead fly in the conservatory, so we thought we'd have a look at it. So, let's zoom in. Ugh, look. Look at those wings. It's got a few cobwebs on it, I think. But yeah, let's get in close to that and look at those wings. Look at that, look. The little wing itself has got little hairs on it. How many of you are going, yeah, at the moment? Yeah, are you going, uh, no, you're not, are you? And then, <laughs> it's not scary, is it? Look. What, are you going behind me? Ah, oh, it's a bit scary. Look at this, watch. Flies have got things called compound eyes, which means their eyeballs, look, are made up of lots and lots of tiny little lenses. So if we zoom in on the eyeball, look at that. There you go. Lots of tiny little lenses inside the eye. And I think we've got another fly here. I don't know if this one's going to be any better. Let's have a look. Oops. Let's have a look. Same sort of thing really. Look, there's the fly's eye. Look, made up of tiny little lenses. <laughs> Ew, come on, get me, get back. All right, we'll take the fly away. There we go. 
What else should we have a look at? We have got a flower. Let's have a look at a flower and see what that's like. Let's have a look at this flower. Look, Ooh, it doesn't look much different than the spider, does it? It's just a nicer colour. Where are we? Where's the flowers? There we go, look. Let's zoom in. Look at that. This is a tiny little flower. I wonder if we can go closer. Let's have a look. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, I think we might be too far away from this one because it's so small. Can we look? No, not much to see there really, is there? Right, shall we see what a jewel looks like? Hey, look at that, look. There you go. There's a jewel in a ring. Look. look at that. It's sparkly. We have got... We caught now, if you don't like spiders, and you're scared of spiders, we saw a live spider running around. Whoops, oh, oh, let me get this on there. In our, in our conservatory. So we thought we'd see if we could see it. So if you don't like spiders, look away now. So this is a, a real life spider look. Can you see it that Spence? Look at all those tiny little hairs on its legs. Ooh. How did you pick it up? I didn't, I just put a piece of paper down and it ran on top of it. But look, you wouldn't think it's got so, so hairy, would you? It's little legs. So if you don't like spiders, you won't like this. Look, there's its like ugh, furry body. Look, it's not running. It's playing it? dead. I think it is playing dead. That's what they do. You see, they pretend. I wonder if we can make it move a bit. They tend to sort of. Uh, oops! Oh, 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 it's running around. Uh, I think that's enough. Should we let the spider go? Yeah. Ready? Come on, spider. Whoops! Oh, there it goes. Well, it's run off. Where's it gone? Oh, well, you're going to have a look at yeah. that then. What's that? That's a that's something we got from a magazine, wasn't it? Yeah, put it down here. Yeah, I see. Right, let's see. There you go. Look, do you want to do it? Yeah. Look, what's that? That's a dead bug. That's a that's a scorpion, but it's a tiny little. Let's keep it still. Wait a minute. It's a baby dead. No, it's a scorpion. It came with a magazine that Isabella bought. I think it was like about creepy crawlies or something. And. Uh, See if we can get it to focus properly. Ready? In a minute. Not easy to see on that one, is it? Because it's round, it doesn't fit inside the thing very well. Let's just see if we can get it focused in. Should we have a look? You can see its stinging tail or something. Where is it? That stinging tail. Oh, look there. Look. There is the scorpion stinging tail. Look at that. It stings. Yeah, that's what it stings you with. See that little spike there? Yeah, I've never seen a... Well, I've seen them on TV, but I've never seen a real scorpion. So, should we do some body parts? So let's have a look at some skin. Watch. Let's have a look at a fingernail or near one. This skin's usually really horrible because it's not how you how you remember seeing it. So look, let's have a look at a knuckle. And then there you, you can see my back. No. Oh no, I don't think we'll do your bad. And watch, we have a look at Daddy's beard. Ooh, look at this, this is horrible, watch. This is what, look, can you see the hairs coming out of my chin? Look, you can see the hairs actually coming out. Ugh. Let's go to it, let's see if we can get. That's disgusting. It is, isn't it? Look, look at that. My knee's disgusting. Now, the really creepy one, should we have a look at my eyeball? Yeah. Are you ready for this? Ready? Wait a minute, let me zoom out. Look, let's get this the right way around. Look, ready? There is my eye, and if you look, look at that. You can see all the little bits that make your eye up. If we go even closer, uh, can we get closer to my eye? Yeah, it doesn't look as good if you go closer. But yeah, look, let's just get my eye left here. So if you ever want us to do some more magnifying stuff, or you can think of some magnifying stuff that you want us to have a look at through the microscope, magnify, just let us know, yeah? Yeah! Can you think of anything else? No. No. Just me. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, and you hurt. Ah, my neck. So then, if you'd like to like, comment and subscribe to our channel, it would be... It certainly would. Until we see you next time on Wacky Wednesday, we'll say... Bye-bye. Bye-bye.